Wouldn't that be awesome if you got attacked by those seagulls? This is the American uh, police now coming to tell me that hey, there's no excuse to the America. No, you can swim in this water. There's kids over there probably. I was just kidding anyway. <laughs> Sylvia, I think that hooligan scallywag over there actually went in the water. Ugh. How dreadfully <laughs> awful. Hey everybody and welcome to the Add Him in Different Places show. I think we're at episode 34 now. I don't really have an idea. I'll check when I upload this. <clears throat> If you're following the website AdamJosh.com or the uh, Mr. Adam Josh YouTube channel, you'll know that I just recorded a demo version of a new song that I wrote called This Is The One That Made Me Famous. Yes, <clears throat> it's silly title. It's a silly title, and inflammatory. But put yourself in my position. I could call a song whatever I wanted to call it. I could call it. I could have called it. I saw you as a blur, or then you faded away. And then I thought to myself, self, why don't you just call it something ridiculous? Because you have the power to do that as a writer. The reason that I like music, and the reason that I've always enjoyed playing music, even though I'm not profiting from this in any sort of monetary sense right now, is music is like my playground. Like, I'm, I'm very fortunate in that I had musical parents, and I'm very fortunate in that um, I have an ability to learn things. I, I don't know. My, I can learn how to play anything. I know that. I can learn how to do anything, pretty much. And I'm fortunate in the sense that I play drums, bass, guitar, I play keyboard, although I don't have one here yet. And uh, so I, I'm, I enjoy music. It's my playground. It'll always be my playground. It always has been my playground. With all that said, I wanted to record an acoustic version of This Is The One That Made Me Famous. For, especially for, the viewers of Add Him In Different Places. And those of you who have been following along since the very first had him in different places, the one where I was in bathrooms mostly. So this is for you guys. Thank you for sticking through all these episodes and the craziness that is my random life. <clears throat> I'm going to try to do this. Now I'm not going to edit this, so if I screw up, I screw up. It took me about 30 tracks, 30 tries to get it for the video on the Mr. Adam Josh YouTube channel. And that was with playing an instrument at the same time. So I'm going to try to do it. I haven't played this guitar actually in a long time. Since I bought it, pretty much. But anyway. I saw you as a blur, then you faded away. Couldn't grasp out the sands as another mistake.
that sand as an early mistake Saw you as a blur and then you faded Have a vegan and green save the world. Hmm. It's a lot of traffic disease. This is Toronto, man. Yeah. This is Toronto. Top of it, I took a long exit. I should have been on that one. Turn left on Avenue Road. Chalo, ishi bande Toronto bhi ekhle dushlo ka nahi. Rom Museum. Bada mehenga store hoga ji. Ye to dekhe na McDonald's bada busy McDonald's hai. On the new road, then should new Avenue. Avenue Airport. Which one is Avenue? Avenue Road. The Avenue Road, nee? This is a really good spot to keep it safe, I think. last words. It's not like we have to eat it all. Give me a plate and spoon. Well, let's just stop staring at it. Yep. Looks like somebody's playing around with harp or uh, some sort of directed energy at the clouds today. I mean, unless you actually look at that and think that that's normal. Maybe is what we're coming to nowadays. What? That's perfectly normal. That's what clouds look like. They look like fizzed out pieces of something. Watch out, Daryl. Is <laughs> <laughs> there something about jumping in work boots and all? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not too bad. <laughs> did you videotape that? Yeah, I did. Good. <laughs> Still videotaping. 
Do one more. <laughs>